Okay, so we've only got 18 people now. Okay, so we've only got 17 people now. Hello guys, welcome back to SimUK, welcome back to Dawn of Man. I found some interesting things when I was changing the key binding. First one is this. <laughs> that doesn't do much. What about F? No, that doesn't do anything either. Okay, so there are two buttons. What's annoying, a little bit annoying, is you can't go back to it from here. But there are two buttons. Let's do it. Let's just... Yeah. We'll reload. I'll show you what I mean. So we go to settings. We go to controls. Uh, come down here. Hunter selection. Fighter selection. Now I've changed the keybinds for these, but... I'm thinking you can set a group of people to be hunters and a bunch of people to be a fighter. And also I figured out that um, the previous and next work area uh, don't require you to use these. I'd like to... How do you remove... Okay, like that. That's one way, <laughs> That's one way to remove them anyway. Uh, pause has been removed. Uh, not that it matters because you press escape and it, that pauses anyway. There's lots of shortcuts. Uh, what, there's a nice one here that I didn't know about. Return to camp. I don't know where it is. But anyway, oh, there it is. Re move camera back to the settlement in case you get lost. Uh, it, the default is return, but I use space now. Um, but other than that, it's kind of pretty straightforward, really. Uh, hunter selection and fighter selection. There's no information about that. So I don't really know what it does. I pressed it just then, it didn't seem to do anything. I'm going to try again. Um, it's hard to achieve a large population in early eras, only with farming and other technologies will you be able to sustain a large settlement. Yes, I find that to be true. Right, let's go and just turn all these off. Okay, so remove, 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 remove. Right, that's it. So there are no work areas at all now. Nobody has any work to do. Nothing at all. All we've got is stuff to build. And still, we're at 147%. How is that possible? Right, I'm going to speed up time. The only few things I know that we need to build are the haystacks, which just take sticks. One stick to build a haystack. The mortar, yes, I'm glad we've built that. Uh, let's set the limits on the mortar. We're going to see, say we want 100%. flour so one bit of flour for every person something like that I'm guessing that's what's going well that's that's what I'm guessing that is what that is going to do uh, I'm not seeing any flour up here we got loads of bread though look at this the workload is still too high okay well I tell you what out of one stick they've done a bloody good job there considering how much attention to detail this game makes I think that should be one log that then gets chopped up into sticks because that is not one stick is it i've never seen a stick that shape in my life i am being pedantic now i know but you know so much attention to detail and then that <laughs> it just irks me it irks me okay the trader has arrived let's have a look see hello trader i can't figure out which one of you is the trader presumably you yes indeed oh look at that Oh, a wooden spear, a bone spear, bread. We don't need bread. We can make our own now. Logs, no. Dry fish, no, not really. Spirituality, we already have spirituality. Don't we have spirituality? <clears throat> Maybe I should unlock spirituality. It might make everybody happier. So honestly, this lady has nothing I want at all, but there's no way to get rid of her. So that's a button that needs to be added. Uh, it seems at the moment the only way to get rid of somebody is to say, uh, yeah, I'll give you a bread for a bread. 
See you later. And she leaves my bread on the floor. I mean, what a horrid person. So, yes, we're still waiting for these sledges to be built. Total war announcement there. Oh, look at this. What is this? Straw. Well, we got somewhere to put straw at last. And for the first time ever, the second storage tent is starting to be used. Thank goodness for that. We don't have a lot of meat. It's right in the middle of summer. Two Point Hospitals just released something as well. Uh, okay, let's speed things up and just see if we can get all of these jobs done. Cave lion attack. Where, where, where? Help! You are no help at all. Come on, guys. Oh, I don't believe that. So we lo who did we lose? Who did we lose? Where is she? Oh, I'm sorry. We're going to have to take your stuff, Karen. That is shockingly unfair. There were loads of people around to help you, and it just didn't happen. Oh, I'm glad you brought a flipping sled. You old sod. Right, look at this. Look, there is stuff to be harvested. And we've only got the, the summer in which to do it. So if I go F1, that's the help menu. F2 is the stats. F3 is the resources. Oh, this is quite a nice one. I don't think I've seen this one before. So it's like a more detailed breakdown of what we've got. We are out of sticks. That is a bit of a problem. Uh, oh, nice. An overview for the, for the stick situation. Right. So I want 10. Uh, 50, rather. And I want 50. Logs and sticks. 50 of each. Uh, flint. 50. Stone, 10 units is fine. Is this like in storage or is this total? I don't understand fully. Uh, leather, we need to have 125% of leather, which makes sense. Beer is set to 10. Beer, oh no, let's get this sorted out. We need to have 100% beer. 100% beer. 125% water. What's this? Milk. 100% milk. Yeah, I suppose we sh should be running a surplus, shouldn't we? So with bread then, let's say 100%. So everybody gets some bread. That's 100%. That just keeps going and going and going. Let's try and have 100% fish. And 100% meat. That might be too much, I think. Well, that's weird. A production limit for sledge? Where do we produce sledges from? There must be something later in the game, I imagine. Okay, alright, that's quite a good one. Uh, F3, F4, F5 is a chart. Straw population is growing. Domestic animals is low. Uh, workload is reducing at last. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Domestic... Sorry about that. I just uh, hit F9, which is, <laughs> it, which is the button that stops my recording from happening. Luckily, I spotted that. Otherwise, I'd still be rabbiting on, but no one would be listening. Okay, so we've only got 18 people now. Okay, so we've only got 17 people now, and <laughs> wow, I mean, timing is unbelievable. We still haven't got these flipping sledges made. We've got all the equipment we need, 
nobody's making these sledges. So what is everybody doing? I don't understand where all these workloads are coming from. Because nobody's doing anything. Nothing is actually being done. There are no tasks. Or maybe there are things being done. Maybe... I mean, all year round we have meat hanging off this stuff. Maybe that's wrong. Maybe it should all be put in the storage. Because look at this. That's pretty much full. And now that's half full. So I have been a terrible leader. I have just been working these poor people to the bone. And what we needed to do was take all the tasks off. So that these lovely people could get the food put away. You see, if you could organise people, if you could say, right, I just want you to work on the meat. Do you know what I mean? If you could do that, I think, I think that's a mechanic of the game that probably needs to be adjusted in the future. I like their idea, but it just doesn't seem to work, in my humble opinion. Unless, of course, I'm doing something wrong. Good doggy, good doggy. We've still got some miserable people, look. Workload, 118%. Nobody's doing anything. The active tasks are at zero. Let's just give everybody a bit of time off so that you can all just chill out, go and sit in the tents, relax, sit around the fire, have a bit of a sing song, enjoy the storm. I'm not sure these are tasks. Going to tent, going to the storage tent. All of these guys are unproductive, right? But, 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 the workload is still 118%. So me thinks maybe this is a problem. This is a mistake. speed time up and see if they go and do these tasks and then see what happens at the end of it. <laughs> ah, we, we are finally getting control of things. So, pending tasks come down here but they don't automatically go up here. That's what it appears to suggest. So let's get all the tasks done and out the way. And then in the next episode, we'll... Uh, we'll slowly start adding them again and try and work out how the system works so that we can be more effective. Why are you so bloody miserable? You haven't got anything to do. Well, maybe that's why. Maybe you're bored. See, look bow and arrows but I click on it and it doesn't come up here I'm not fully 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 grasping how this system works it seems oh look knowledge spirituality should we do it or should we wait that's required for a totem and megalithism Let's do it. Let's have a totem. Let's have at least get one thing built today. Look at look. Right click to cancel it. But why are they pending tasks? Why aren't they tasks? Why aren't they being done? It does confuse me. Where did I put that thing? 
Uh, it's going up there, isn't it? The totem. Let's go right ahead and build. If I can figure out where the hell the totem is. Where is the totem? Oh, there. <laughs> Which way should I face it? It's got to be there, isn't it? Nice. I like that. Okay, uh, so the tasks are build a totem. That's going to take two people. Uh, you're repairing that hut. That's going to take one person. Workload is 29%. Don't understand what these are doing down here. So you're building bows, right? Now, is that because we don't have enough bows? Yeah, I think it is. So in order for you to build bows, I imagine you're going to have to come and sit in here. Am I right? Let's just slow that down and have a look at this real quick. Unlocks the construction of the totem structure, which helps with keeping morale high in the settlement. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. And here we are. We have a builder. This old man been his live stream to have a totem on top of the mountain and now he's going to have one a new human was born congratulations that's a healthy strapping baby boy right see tent repair not being done all these people not doing anything so what, why aren't they being done? How do I assign somebody to this task? Is it because we didn't have any leather? We didn't have the necessary equipment to make leather and that's holding up the production of the next thing. Is that what it is? Is that what we... Is that what we figured out? No, we haven't figured that out at all. I still have no idea. It's just, it just isn't being done. Oh, we've lost some bread. Somewhere, presumably in there. I don't know where. In there? Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Do we have a totem? Nope, not built. Right, we'll build this and we'll wrap that up for this episode. We only need four sticks, apparently. What is that? <laughs> it's a mouflon. You some sort of mouflon. Uh, oh my god, we're in winter, we have no food. Um, really quickly, chaps. There's a mouflon here. Wants eating. Oh, you haven't got a spear. Have you got a spear? You've got a spear. Come here, quick. Quick, before he comes out of the water! How are you going to get him if you kill him in the water? What are you doing? Come on, old woman. What? Look, you can't kill him when he's in the water. He's totally... <laughs> oh, you got no spears left. Oh, I get it. Every time you throw a spear, we lose a spear. What about bow and arrow? Come on, Corkle, old man. Look at this. Key's going for it. I I think when that mouflon gets to the other side of the uh, lake, it's just going to die. Shall we see? Because clearly that was getting hit loads of times. It's got no health left. I reckon as soon as it gets here, it dies. You watch. And we just had three... I told you! <laughs> yeah, there's a slight bug in the game. Is that a wolf? <gasps> That's the first wolf I've seen. 
There's no way we can get over there in time. I'm not going to bother running all the way around the edge of the lake just to get to that wolf. Well, we are low on food. Well, there's food over there. It'll take a long time to get it, though. Need some young, healthy people. Are you a young, healthy person? You are. You're a miserable young, healthy person. Go and get some food. Oh, do you know what? You walk so slowly, I can't be bothered. Oh, you are young. No, you're an old man. You're an old woman. You're an old man. That's a sledge. Are you the trader? Oh, go. Oh, okay, let's just buy some food. What's that problem solved, doesn't it? Trade value of 10. Here, yeah, take those. See you later. Okay, guys, I'm going to wrap it up there because, um... Well, it's nearly winter, isn't it? Should we just speed through to the end of winter? speed through to the end of winter. I did say we were going to wait for the totem to be built as well. Make that a priority. Make sure it doesn't get done, because that's the way it seems to work. Uh, let's just slow it down and see if that Ibex thing is still here. It's still there, but there's less meat now and less... Oh, come on. There must be somebody young and healthy and happy. You're an old man. You're an adult woman. Here, here, adult woman. Come hither. quick as you can don't swim it's flipping winter wow she was keen she jumped straight in there no messing about what I'd love to see is dangerous things in the water like crocodiles and I don't know what I'd love to see is this game expanded all the way back to the dinosaur period and play from there that would be epic if that was a dlc i'd jump on that i'd absolutely jump on it pretty much like she jumped in the water oh i didn't bother to check if she had a by face it was pretty freaking lucky she did that is rubbish at butchering isn't it definitely need some better weapons oh did it disappear it disappeared before we got there You're going to have to kill this half-dead donkey. Horse. Quick as you like. One, two, three. No, why did you do that? Stupid woman. Right, there we go. Kill. Kill. I know it's a horse. Kill it. What do you mean you don't want to? We need the meat. Everybody's going to die unless you kill this lame horse. Look, he can barely run. You haven't got a spear. That's what you're telling me, isn't it? Just come and stand next to the nice horsey. I see you girls checking out my lumps. I see you girls checking out the front of my trunks. I see you girls <laughs> checking out my rump and back to my sugar lumps. Okay, nobody's building this flipping totem. She didn't have a spear on her. How do I make sure people have spears on them? I don't know how to get the game to do what I want it to do. It's, it's a bit frustrating in that sense. Hey, you're a religious type. No, this. No, yes, that. Build it. You're going to get dry fish. How is dry fish going to help you build this? Well, we survived the winter, believe it or not. Still nobody's building the totem. 
Good lord. What is wrong with you peeps? You'll all be a lot happier if you just build a totem. Uh, it's not happening. Guys, I'm going to wrap it up there. Look at this. Look at these pending tasks. I don't understand where these are coming from. These are just like general jobs that need to be done. I get that. But I mean, come on. Come on, people. And we have no food. Oh, splendid. I'm going to wrap it up there, guys. In the next episode, I'm going to have to somehow turn this all around because it's turned into a bit of a mess. A bit of a mushy mess. And yet we still don't understand how the workload system thing works. It's so confusing. And we have no fuel. <laughs> We're in a right smelly mess. Thanks for watching. Take care of yourselves. Till next time. Bye. -bye.